Hi everybody, today we're going to look at some useful commands in Kali Linux. Also, you can maybe use them in Ubuntu. Uh, those are the operating system I've been, systems I've been working on much than uh, others. So I would really say that we, these are very useful commands. Thanks for being with us and please don't forget to subscribe. So we're going to go straight to your terminal and... Um, the first uh, what uh, command we're going to use, we're going to see the PW. But um, PW, how does it work? It tells you where you are. PWD. You click there. It's, it, it puts you, it shows you that in root folder. So now we're going to go to another command which is called a CD. CD means let's go to, we're going to download load okay you enter hit enter you see we have we in downloads but and then in downloads we want to see what is in downloads we say ls then we say enter you see in 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 this in this we have a file this is called beginning html5 we have this file also it's an image we also have these pdfs and stuff you get me so all of these are uh, they are what in downloads so since we in downloads so and these are the files we want to go to a command we've seen those ones but we want to see a command which gonna help us to create a directory so in this we want to create a directory maybe a folder where we're gonna maybe store our music or whatever so in that we're gonna say I'm gonna create a directory like this you see this is a folder you see this is a folder so since this is a folder I can also cd to that folder and see what's in that folder you see these are files but this is a folder so I'm gonna say cd to that folder which is gonna be old cd to old you can see it says no such it says no such directory I wonder why let me see copy that and say since we there say cd to that yes so i did not put in the right thing so if i'm in that directory remember we are here in downloads then we move into the folder which is in downloads which is called old then we're going to say ls so which means we're listing all the inform the things which are in us uh, in 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 old enter you can see oh these are the things i have in old you get me i have some pictures they i have many many things here and uh, some softwares in here and the word document in here okay so now since we can see that uh what we're gonna do we're gonna go if you click if you press cd space it takes you back to root but now if we can recall this uh, CD to downloads. I'll go back. Then I say CD to uh, old. You see, if you say CD and you don't specify, it's gonna take you back to root fold. So now here, if you wanna specify, you can say CD one dot. Then say enter. So it simply means it takes you back. No, let me say CD uh, dot dot. It yes. So. One dot it it one dot means in the directory where you are. Two dots simply means you're going to one step away from this folder. So in that folder, I want us to create another folder, or we can create another folder here. So this is what we, the command, the third command we wanted to use. Remember, if you in a, a one folder and say cd, it's gonna take you back to the root folder here. But if you say cd dot, it's going to take you one step. cd dot is going to still remain in the folder where you are. But if you say cd dot dot, it simply means it's going to take you out of that folder and it'll take you to the next folder behind that folder. Okay. So now what we're going to do, we're going to create a folder inside the downloads folder. So what we do, we use a command called mk, which means make directory dir. So we give space, then we give the directory a name. 
so you can give this name and say Kali now so if we in Kali now and we say enter yes that's created so now if you say ls we list all what is there we can see the folder called Kali now you can see we had only old then we can see the folder called what Kali now so in that Kali now we can go to Kali now by say cd2 we copy this to avoid wrong spelling and uh, put in that go there so we in Kali now so when you're in Kali now we can create another folder inside Kali now if you want so but now we won't create anything but now we want to see ls we want to see what is in Kali now when you list in Kali now nothing is there so okay we want to create another folder in Kali now we say m k d i r okay that's right we say and say we can create this folder called um inside okay one word then you say enter so if now we say ls we list you can see there is a folder called um inside so we created a folder inside a folder in this is a folder downloads there's a folder inside it then we create a folder inside it so if then we can say this is a place where we can put our stuff in there so i guess guys you understand that part so we're gonna come and uh, see you in the next part whereby we're gonna explain more of useful commands these are the uh some of the commands which you will never run away from uh no matter which unix operating system you're using you never run away from this but these are not the only ones we have a lot of them which we can we didn't show you the okay let me show you another command uh whereby we can say r m so r m stands for remove let me copy this and uh, say space and uh, put this here and i uh, say okay it says there's no that directory you get me we want to say rm it simply means you you want to rm to remove a directory but i'm i, I didn't put it right the command should be r m d r d i r yes so it simply means remove that so we like deleting it so we put this here and we put this inside say aha uh -huh. remember we had a folder called i'm um, inside inside kali now so we removed it to use the command called rm directory so i'm removing the what the directory into that so if i'm in kali now now if i list there should be nothing there so i'm gonna say ls means i wanna list there's nothing you can see so we can go back also and say cd uh two two dots which means we're gonna come out of kali now you can see we in kali now we remove the folder which was in kali now which we created and say go back so we go back and then we want to re remove this folder called kali now let's first list and you see it in downloads ls uh ls yes when we list you can see kali now is here so guys let us let us do this we're gonna clear our screen and say c l e a r clear we say okay then we're gonna say ls we're gonna list again okay we got that so we're gonna remove this folder whatever we did not find there because it was just for testing we're gonna delete it so since we in downloads we're gonna say r m stands for remove d i r directory so we give it a space after that space you copy this okay <clears throat> and uh, you paste it here and uh, you say on enter so that's gone then we're gonna say ls we list you see in the first listing here up you can see kali now and you can see old so since you can see these two but now in the second one remember we did remove it so after removing this simply means this folder is no more existing so it means it was removed totally so that's the way we create directories list them what the content inside also we learned how to remove a folder so you know in 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 kali linux we use much commands than 
using graphical user interface you can also use the um, graphical user interface to delete folders but this is more effective and the person who's using linux is expected to be knowing how to use the command line yes guys please don't forget to subscribe on our channel and if this was useful please uh what you're gonna do uh if this was useful uh please like the video subscribe and also if you need us to uh do a tutorial on something else please tell us we will come back to in the next video also we might teach you more commands in car linux thanks for watching if you did not understand you can rewind the video and learn command by command the best thing you should do open your your what your 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 terminal and start doing this practical practical you have to do practice practically not by theory or listening and go no don't listen and go open your kali and test whatever we have done so if also using your ubuntu and other flavors of linux it's okay you can use these commands they work 100 percent there is no way that they won't work and uh, i think that's the end of our tutorial see you in the next video thanks for watching